And we are underway. The Rapids defending the goal away to our right-hand side. Vancouver getting us started here at Dick Sporting Goods Park on this Sunday night. Head coach in Italy here for A.S. Mezzana. Assistant coach at Livorno. Barrios with the crossbar, denying the Colombian. In on goal was Michael Barrios looking for number eight. And you can see, listen, Barrios gets this. He looks, he's trying to go high. Just a little, get him, just gets underneath that just a little bit too much. Absolutely fantastic. The other thing he could have done. Here comes the call. It's go up, and that's 1 0. And that is Danny Wilson. Danny Wilson with the header. Jack Price with the delivery. And Maxime Kropo is beaten. Well, let's take a look at the movement. Again, I don't, they just look lost. Look how easy Danny Price puts a fantastic ball. But look at Danny Wilson's unmarked all by himself. They leave him alone. And I believe it was Piquel who just left him there. And Danny Wilson perfectly gets up, snaps a header down, puts it in the back of the net, puts Colorado up 1-0. Wilson's second goal of the season. I touched it with my feet, you guys. It wasn't with my hands. It wasn't with my hands. Given away by Wilson. That was a real giveaway. Work to do here. Oh, it's 1-1. And Danny Wilson at one end, the hero. At the other end, he's given it away. And Vancouver Whitecaps have leveled things up from a shocking mistake. Let's take a look. It's coming across. Yep. I mean, just playing a square ball. Something you do not want to do. Nice ball in. And listen, White goes high. He sees... And watch, Yarbo goes down trying to get this ball. I mean, fantastic. Absolutely. Ball laid in and just cuts it, closes it. Caicedo does a great job of winning that ball, laying it off. White makes a great little diagonal run. First time hit, doesn't take a touch. Hits it off the crossbar, ties the game up 1-1. We're back at it, and the second half is underway. The Rapids kicking from left to right in this second 45. Namli. Namli still rides two challenges to Eunice Namli. He wants to go a goal. Oh, that's not too far away. Silky smooth, isn't it? Look at this. Little hop up. Let me get this ball back. I am going to take you inside with my pace. I'm going to set this up. And look at that knuckle. Look at that ball dipping. You can see Crapo coming all the way to his left and it starts coming back to his right. Watch this. All of a sudden he freezes like, whoa. Gould, well, had a run 30 yards. Cavallini still with a chance there, and it ricochets wide. Again, you got to give Vancouver credit. This counterattack is fantastic. Goal comes in here. I mean, it drops. A little fortunate there for for uh, for Vancouver, and that ball kind of drops. Cavallini hits this, and Yarbrough gets just enough of his hip on it. Galvan into Namli in close quarters. Shinishiki with his first touch. Namli! Ricochet Estevez! Oh my word! It's the great wall of Whitecaps. The ball moving around. Look at the little one two, the little clip in there. It's going to far post to save. Here comes a shot. It gets blocked again. Estevez again shoots it. They block it. You just got to give Vancouver credit right now. They're blocking, they're diving, they're sacrificing everything, but Colorado's moving the ball so well. Shinishiki side foots that, trying to go to the far post, and you can just see, we talked about it, the wall of white. The referee looks at his watch. Bit of magic from Namli. Chance here! Oh, and Crapo right at the death. And there is the final whistle. That was the last chance of the game.